All right, I'm just going to get right to the point. The earliest images of Jesus Christ were black. And here's the proof. The first Christian nation was in Ethiopia. There was an Ethiopian king named Haile Selassie. His name meant power of the Trinity. So nobody put a gun to the Ethiopians' heads when they converted to Christianity. They knew that this was a black prophet. And beyond his color, it was about his words and what they learned. But you have a so-called conscious community out here that they want to paint the image. They want to accept what Europeans gave them, which is a white image of Christ. And they didn't want to do any research. It's easy to just run their mouths online and not do any research. But when Haile Selassie came here, they were calling him the Lion of Judah. Okay, he was the emperor of Ethiopia, the whole Rastafarian movement. Everybody loves Bob Marley, right? Well, Bob Marley's religious belief, and he was a great musician, by the way. You can't even find a cuss word in his music. His music is timeless. He believed that Haile Selassie was the second coming of Christ. Rastafarians based their whole belief system on the Bible. So I find it really, really irritating to see so-called conscious people bashing the Bible, bashing an image of Christ that nobody even really worships, not at least not in the young generation. Okay? The movement against so-called white Christianity was started by Elijah Muhammad when he was teaching in the 40s and 50s and 60s, and by the 60s, Malcolm X took over, and they were going hard against white Christianity to convert people to their religion but this was before crack came in the 80s before heroin came in the 80s after they done killed everybody who they thought was a threat to their system in the 60s that's when all the drugs flooded the inner cities okay stop pointing your finger at religious people these bloods and crips and hip hoppers out here they don't have white Jesus on their walls why are you still online making fun of images of white Jesus and acting as if that is our problem? As if it's not cocaine and molly and lean and drugs in our community, guns in our community. You're not conscious. This ha there has to be a level. If y'all are conscious, there has to be several levels above consciousness. And to tell you the truth, yes, most people are unconscious. That's the first stage in the mind. When you go about day-to-day -day life, you're not really conscious. You're just living. People become conscious. They have little knowledge. That's the second stage of the mind. The third stage of the mind is super conscious. That's the super conscious mind. This is where the power to manifest comes from. See? That, that's a very narrow area of consciousness. And above that, you have the magnetic mind. And above that, you have the infinity mind, the fifth stage of the mind. This is what the elders told me, the wise scientists who wrote your history, who created your planet, and who will judge you one day. There's 24 of them. That's why there's 24 hours in a day. Ask an atheist why there's 24 hours in a day. They can't answer you. So this younger generation has got a real problem. And I, I have a solution. Change your deodorant. If there's aluminum in your deodorant, that's going to be messing up your brain. All right. Then there's also something that can help you with memory and learning abilities. It's called Hooperzine A. Google that. Hooperzine. H-U-P-E-R-Z-I-N-E. -E. There you go. All right. This rabbit hole goes deep. All right. But Christianity was based off a black Christ. And they know that. And they buried all of the images of that. All right. And the earliest believers in Christ were black people. Nobody put a gun to their head. And it gets even deeper when people uh, claim that Christianity was forced on black slaves. Um, no, not all slave masters wanted their slaves to be Christians because that would make them equal. That's actually how you got your rights. Martin Luther King was a Christian. Toussaint Louverture, the leader of the slave rebellion in Haiti, was Christian. See, all of this, all of this relates. If you check Chris Rock's new movie... In the movie, he was playing uh, a, a Haitian revolutionary, running around with the Haitian flag. So they know about all of this. 
there's a lot of imposters out there, a lot of wannabes. They took Dr. York from y'all, and y'all are a messed up community right now in dire need of leadership. But all this anti-Christianity stuff has to stop, all right? Because you're just playing yourself. You're just making yourself look stupid and uneducated. And who benefits from your non-religiousness? Huh? <laughs> all religion is is law. Anyway, there's much more to come. I got to get my thoughts together on this. I just want to put this out. Every time I get online, God shows, God just points me right to the, to the ignorance. Points me right to the ignorant people. There's a higher intelligence that has an eye on y'all. <laughs> I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all. Y'all have, have a lot to learn about this God thing. And it's not a theory. Your atheism is a theory. And I'm going to leave it at that. Well, I will speak on this more in the future, but we're going to lay that foundation. Matrix Code 3, uh, please like, subscribe, and share. We have to stop these so-called conscious people from acting like they're better than you because they don't eat meat. This is a meat eater who showed you that Jesus was black. And they've taken your religion for so long that you think it's, it's, it's theirs, just like everything. They've had this land for so long you think it's theirs. Do your research. Okay, do the knowledge before speaking. You never put wisdom before knowledge, and that's the problem with the conscious community. They, they raise the women above them. Don't ever do that. Woman represents the earth. Earth is earth. Terrestrial is terrestrial. Celestial is celestial. The stars are in the sky. You are down here on earth, on Mother Earth, Mater. That's the root word of the matrix, matriarchy, matter. You understand? Matriarchy means rule of the mother. So all this goddess mother worship is where the conscious so-called community has gone wrong. And you are those who are led easily in the wrong direction and hard to be led in the right. right. A.K.A. the 85% on the poor part of the planet Earth called North America. And 8 plus 5 is 13. There's still... A bunch of fools running around with 13 in their names. You are pathetic, and I feel sorry for you. You have nothing better to do with your lives than sit and make jokes about people who don't even believe in a white Jesus. You believe in it more than they do. Don't talk to me about the Council of Nicaea. The Christians before the Council of Nicaea were in Ethiopia and in Egypt, meaning there were black people who were Christians before the Romans. All right, so stop. Enough with the anti-Bible stuff. Enough. Jesus was a Jewish prophet. The Nazis did not like the Jews because they knew those Jews had some type of black blood and some type of connection. And they burned all evidence that they could find of a black Jewish prophet. But yes, the first Christians were actually Jews. And when you're talking about the Bible and the Old Testament and things like that, Adam and Eve, those are actually books of the Jews. Moses was a prophet to the Jews. But you're so brainwashed. You think the whole Bible is just the New Testament. <laughs> Y'all got a lot to learn. Y'all are the brainwashed ones, if you but knew it. We'll be speaking more on this in the future. Sit tight. Peace.